What's up guys, Barry Gaming here, back with some more Idle Heroes, and today it is update time for our account, because in reality, what we're going to try to do for the time being, we're not going to be putting all our power really back into our like Doom Terminator Vulcan, what we're going to try to do is kind of optimize our Lord of Fear Aspen for next star expedition, so in order to do that, we really need to focus on his tenants, now one of them being... We probably need to change over to an Ankiri Maro, but I'm going to have to find a decent B copy for that. The Aspen, I found a decent one, so I think the Aspen is going to be the next one that we really put some power into. So, uh, first and foremost, what we need to do is, do we actually have the resources? We don't. Um, do we have any heroes that are chilling with imprints that we're not actually using? Yes, we got you right here. These can just completely be ripped out of you. They are unnecessary. So uh, let's go back to that other Aspen uh, and let's start investing some power in him. So what we're also going to be doing here is we're going to be doing their trees as well. Right now, I'm going to hold off on it because what we're going to do is we're going to get rid of all this power that we have on this Vulcan and this 2C Lago. Uh, because again, we're not going to care about the Vulcan right now until more campaign or something where he's a lot better in comes out. We want everything in here. So on top of that, what we need to do is we need to upgrade this skin to Mythic. Now, it looks like it's a very, very easy one because you can use just about any skin because it is a limited skin, I think, right? The lowest tier. Yeah, it's just a limited skin, but it does attack, HP, and crit damage. 3%, 3%, yeah, it doesn't really matter which one, so we can go with the cool looking one, be part of the cool key club, but what we're also going to need to do is get more skins, so we need more skin fodder, that is for sure, we'll just use up all the chests we do have and see where we're at, that puts us at 3, this puts us at 4, I think we need one more, if I remember correctly, means we do need to come up here we need to come to the shop and we do need to just buy a cheapo skin 50 works okay so that should be enough wait where'd it go did i buy a copy again i bought a copy again didn't i i swear to god i keep doing this every single time i buy copies and i don't buy the skins oh my god i'm like why are they so expensive uh one of these days guys one of these days i'll actually learn my lesson so let's get you powered up even further there we go let's remold this skin feed off uh you yeah and then one two three four five that's good remold it get higher stats perfect we'll take it um does that actually give us an upgrade over here Probably not because we had to like, you have to like spend skins to get skins. And if it's just a limited one, it's nowhere near as good. Uh, but that is awesome. We do need to get a flag for him as well. So let's see what we can do here. Don't know what we have for resources as far as getting the flag. But we'll find out. Um, also, have dark flags. Um... Doesn't look like we have any in the bag right now. Do we have chests for flags? We do. Perfect. So we can grab four of these. We're going to have to level one of them up on him himself. This. And luckily, yeah, we do have a lot of fodder down here that's pretty good. Just turn a lot of it into dust and then use the dust to level it up. I wish there was just like a quick level process or I wish this this the order of like where the artifacts are were the opposite kind of like how it is in the forge. The Ormus workshop is like perfect. Another one of these. So that's there we go. Remove that. Let's go make that one splendid. So. We almost have enough. We have to do some disassembling, which we should be able to just chuck a bunch of these things in here. Maybe like that. Yep, that's pretty good. And we can come over here and we can build up the flag. So we got the base version, the one star. Come on over here, the one star, the one star, the there. And then finally get this up to splendid. There we go. 
go forge all right so we got another splendid flag for him no not for you close but not not quite uh for you and again we got like a decent copy like the attack's really not the best but it's better than nothing at this point there's the flag are gonna have to re-roll this stone actually we're gonna have to upgrade the stone good lord we just don't have the resources to do anything right now feels bad we have to, i've already been buying out like spirit to level my stuff up <laughs> now i gotta keep buying dust oh it is a never-ending money hole pit i guess for the time being the speed attack will have to do for a tenant copy which kind of is rough but like it is what it is again and then yeah we will start doing the tree actually we can do the tree kind of right now too we got enough resources it should be fine we should be able to get it up decently because again, he's going to be the best one for that first slot right here. So any upgrades we do pump into him go straight to our Lord of Fear Aspen for some crazy PVE damage. So let's keep leveling this up. Let's see how far we can take this. I think we can get it to 80. I don't know if we can get it to 100. I think you need like another 5 million. Yeah, even 80 is, is actually we ran out of spiritual essence. That's kind of crazy. That's actually really, really crazy. Um okay and then we're gonna have to level him up but again i've been buying the spirit every day and i'm just tapped out of spirit too so oh my goodness and i've been hitting this every day <laughs> and maxing that out and it's just a forever thing so we're gonna have to pause we're gonna have to wait um we could get resonance gear on him could upgrade this set of gear let's see Resident suit of gear. We do need to go to a warrior set. We're missing the chest piece. Ugh. Ugh. All right. Who's got a chest piece? Who's sitting on some six star set of gear that doesn't need a split gear setup? Um, I guess we could steal that. You know what? You don't need any gear. Four C's. You are just not you at all. Uh, oh wait no we don't need to do that what am i talking about we need to just go up to here yeah i just realized that um oh, i guess we don't have it for either of them i guess we never re-rolled his stuff let's see if we have an aspen here we do have an aspen so that saves us there adele grew no we have an aspen here that would be huge help if we did or to fear aspen no let's forge that Oh, no, we're out of gold to go to the three-star set. <laughs> okay, so uh, this is going to take a little bit longer than I expected to get this done because we're literally just tapped out on resources for today. And uh, I guess the last thing we can do is we can jump in here and we can actually do some of the guild collection. But yeah, this guy stays around. You can see it's a monthly event as a certain tier that are uh, the upright, which is cool. But let's do 40 in the guild and see if we get lucky and hit anything good to wrap this up. Got a full artifact. We love to see that. Ooh, oh, just one shard, really. One stinking shard. We need to get the artifact before we can even use that shard. We have to get that treasure before we can use that shard, which sucks. I feel like the first time you pull any of them, it should just give you the whole one. Oh, nothing, nothing. This is bad. Oh, we got a new one anything else oh, we got a whole anytime you see like 20 30 or 40 that means you got like the entire treasure it's just it gives you to it in shard form after that oh i did a one times are you stupid barry oh my god now i have to do single pulls oh i got a lot of that like teapot thingy whatever it is okay we got to do single this is stupid <laughs> what have i done oh we got the whole green one though that's cool i guess it's more dramatic effect right Ah, oh, geez, you know, we're not doing this. No, 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 no. We're going to do something else. And that is something I've already been buying too many of these every day. Oh, this is going to hurt. I just, I just want to do a 10 pull. I just want to finish this up with a 10 pull here. Let's just do it right here. All right, come on. Show me something good. Give me, give me the pink. Give me the pink artifact. Nope, nothing. But I mean, it still gets upgrade stuff, which is good. Can't craft anything. We're just pretty much upgrading a ton of stuff. Which means, uh, wait, we can upgrade again. Oh, cool. We can ascend them. Cool. And then more bonuses, which is awesome. So 
that's the upgrades for now. We're going to save everything else. I'm going to keep buying out Hand of Midas like every day and the Spirit in the Shop because we have a lot of work to do leading up to next and or not anniversary. I mean, leading up to anniversary, yes, but leading up to the next uh, attack we do on Star Expedition, we really, really need to try to get on Kiri Maru to try to optimize, optimize this even further. And we're going to finish leveling the Asmodel up to 100 as well. So we have both of them pretty much good to go. And then we just got to work on that on Kiri Maru. Like I said, honestly, maybe an E plus on Kiri Maru is still better than a B minus. I'm in wrong. I don't know. We'll have to see. Hopefully you guys enjoy this one. I'll see you guys next time.